A loggerhead turtle injured at sea is on the road to recovery tonight. It's undergoing rehab for the past nine months, and vets are taking it one step more, hoping for a full recovery. News Channel 5's Tanya Rogers has our story. Kahuna barely survived a brutal shark attack last year, and she probably would have died then if she hadn't been rescued off of Hutchinson Island. Kahuna, our large adult female loggerhead, has a uh, osteomyelitis, a bone infection in, in her flippers from a shark attack that had caused an infection in the flippers. After nine months of rehabilitation treatment, antibiotics, vitamins, and surgery, the turtle's future is still uncertain. Now the Loggerhead Marine Life Center staff is hoping an experimental procedure involving hyperbaric oxygen therapy may help heal Kahuna. I think it's a great idea because, um, you know, we've been talking about trying it for six months. It took this long to get it in the works, but there's a lot of turtles out there that can't be released. Hyperbaric oxygen therapy has been used to treat bone infections in humans and in animals. And now doctors are optimistic it will also help the sea turtle. She seems to be responding really well and um, her comfort level has gotten a lot better and we're really hoping that it's going to, you know, achieve the results that we're looking for. During the therapy sessions, Kahuna will breathe 100% oxygen while inside a treatment chamber. And to our knowledge, it's not been done on sea turtles, but we know it's been a practice that's worked really well with horses and, and dogs and cats and other animals. The Equine Hyperbaric Center of South Florida will perform the 45-minute treatments for more than two weeks. The aim is to get her healed enough that they can release her back into the wild, you know, get her back into the ocean. Tanya Rogers, WPTV News Channel 5. Let's hope it works. Interesting. I yeah, know. Technology I love it. today.